Over the summer, the Immigration Project started a migratory grief support program, and the nonprofit aims to help migrants navigate new life in the U.S. more easily by providing resources among their latest offerings this support group has. I, I spoke with those women who started the program and the long-term impact they hope to make. Moving to a new country can come with its challenges, especially on one's mental health. But that's what Camila Grunke and Katia Rodriguez are aiming to target with their migratory grief group. Rodriguez is a licensed psychologist from Mexico and Grunke is a social worker for the Immigration Project. Both came together this summer to help people through what can be a traumatic time. Josefa Archateki talked about the seven migratory griefs. We dive into that quite a bit, including the Ulysses syndrome, which talks about like mental health and its ties to migration specifically. Using these theories as a foundation, they launched a six-week program, but soon realized there was more work to be done. So we noticed that that was kind of a short time frame to get into the nitty-gritty, so we were adding two weeks this time, and moving forward, we believe eight weeks is kind of like that. Um, key spot. Aimed at helping Spanish-speaking individuals, the group will meet once a week to dive into the pre-migration, <laughs> migration, resettling, and assimilating to a new culture. The feedback we got after the first time we facilitated the group was really good overall. The participants received the support well. Alongside helping local migrants, they hope their curriculum can be used beyond the Twin Cities. To complement that, we of course will continue working on a couple things to make it better. Our hope being that the individuals really find support not only with being able to speak about it, but within themselves. Um, it can be really isolating to be in the U.S. Um, coming in scratch, you know, starting from zero. Each session is limited to 10 participants, with their next one coming up on October 29th, next Tuesday. That lasts until December 17th. Grunky says there is still space and time to sign up by contacting the Immigration Project or heading to their website at immigrationproject.org.